Hallo. Hallo. Ich bin Herr Dugan. Welcome to the Prologue Vault. My name is ITO AI Sarah. Here you will be able to get an exclusive insight into some of the war machines, weapons, equipment and enemies of the ITO Special Forces. Hello, this is Mr. Duggan. And no, I'm not Xbox Ahoy. Hey kids and kittens. At the progress of Optic J, I'm taking a first look inside Instellar Marines, and as Vapriamo just told you, we're about to enter the vault, where you get to see all the weapons, materials, and equipment, and enemies of the ITO. Let's enter the vault. Now, just starting off by here. We're uh, Marines, okay. Okay, let's go have a look at the Marines. It's right, we're right by it. Instellar Marines. Our door is opening, and let's... Ooh. I like this. What's that? Looks like we've got an SMG of sorts. Shotgun. A nice shell that. Ooh, whoa. Hey, I like that effect, actually. I like that. Okay. Um, a shotgun. Another SMG. Ooh, we can pull our commerce to safety. And a pistol. And are you? Oh, we're completely intangible as well. Right. Oh wow, you got an SMG and a shotgun at the same time. Sweet Jesus. Okay. Press E for guided tour. The Interstellar Marines Special Operations Immersion Suit is an improved version of the traditional Special Forces Zero G Environment Suit. It comes with a fully integrated dual valve rebreather system, Kevlar armor padding and an interlinked heads-up display and weapons information system. The PDA attached to the Marine's arm provides access to the suit's main functionality and interfaces with the enhanced microprocessing unit in the backpack. The weapons shown here are the MyQ CE6 submachine gun, Ronson and Bernstein OS-1 pistol, and the MyQ TS 2.1 Rhino Tactical Shotgun. Wow. Do, 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 do. Sorry, got a little DD there. Oh! Oh, so that's the background sound. Oh god, threw me off for a second there. Okay, so we've seen the Marines. Let's go back out this way. And there's three other doors we haven't looked at yet. Okay. Well, um, Let's start from left to right, okay? Let's go look at the shark creature. Hello! Is that... Whoa! Shit! Okay, that's a shark creature as well, but me and shot the shit. Whoa! I'm kind of guessing that maybe a Peggy 18 would be advised, advised on this website at some point. <laughs> uh, so, shotgun... Sorry, shark creature, shark creature... Shotgun in action... Another shark creature, SMG, another shark creature, and a big walker thingy a la Battlefield 2142. Awesome source. Okay, well, let, we've, let's have a look at the shark creature and get it, uh, make it official, shall we? Shark creature. Shark creature. Unlucky. A what? Ah, Carcheridon Palemos. So that's probably a Latin name for it. How the hell do those things survive out of water? Sweet. Okay, oh. I forgot you could walk up through that. Sweet. Okay, um. Guided tour, please. The Carcharodon Palamos, also nicknamed the Shark Creature, is a genetically engineered mixture of the most dangerous animals on Earth. Of course! <laughs> How silly of us. Combining the agility and speed of the land predators with the aggressive nature and brute force of the great white shark, the ITO scientists have created a lethal creature using the latest technology in gene engineering. That's... Its massive bone structure and incredible muscle density, together with the vicious and deadly jaws from the white shark, make it the next step in planetary warfare and it will soon be ready for full-scale deployment. This sounds scary. <laughs> full-scale deployment? We're gonna replace Marines now, are we? Sweet. Okay, so that's our guided tour. We've had a look at the shark creature. We've had a look at the marine area. 
the Marines, shark creature. Let's have a look at Mega Megaloon Megaloon Megalodon. 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 Hi, Bab. What the fuck? Sweet Jesus. Whoa. You get to fly ships? Okay, let's have a little look inside. Let's actually just check. Let's have a look over here outside. Yep, you see one side, you see one on the other side. Okay. And. <laughs> you got an in flight movie there. Sweet. Awesome. Uh, can you sit in there? No. Tactical sessions. It's almost like Air Force One. Well, sorry, a small version of Air Force One, I should say. What's down there? Nope, okay, let's go for the guided tour. The third generation Megalodon OPD 3A from Star Crown Aerospace is military space technology at its finest. Since the first version of the Megalodon entered service over 40 years ago, it has remained ITO's most versatile space shuttle. Megalodon's drop capacity and stealth technology make this shuttle a powerful tool in deploying heavy payloads quickly and reliably from orbit to ground and from ground to orbit. The interior configuration shown here is the standard Special Forces Strike Team setup with one operations commander, four Marines, two pilot officers, and one or two Titan walkers. The Megalodon uses a distributed VTOL system for landing, two quad turbine jet engines for maneuvering inside the atmosphere, and four high capacity rocket boosters for zero G travel, reaching a maximum speed of 258,000 kilometers per hour. Okay, we've had a go to all that. Let's have a look back out here. So we've done Marines, Shark, Megalodon. Let's have a look at the Titan Walker. And we'll come back and have a look at the guided to Abyss battle scene afterwards. Titan Walker. Onto the ITO. Titan Walker. Unlocking. Titan Walker. Shorundel M7. Ooh, okay. So, the Ed 209 bot. Cool. Twin cannons. Let's go for the guided tour of it. The Shran Bell M7 Heavy Assault Support Robot is commonly known as the Titan Walker. The prime function of the Titan Walker is to provide cover and suppressive fire in confined areas where tanks and similar heavy assault vehicles cannot enter. It can be equipped with a large array of weapons and is shown here with twin 30mm Gatling guns. The Titan Walker can be remote controlled by a single Marine or it can act on its own through its advanced Pathlock 3.0 AI. Wow. I like. Okay, cool. So that's that. Let's have a look at the battle scene we saw right in the centre here. Do do do. Tra la 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 la. And let's go for a guided tour. That's all for now, I think, folks. Um, join us next time where we'll be looking at the Bullseye Advanced Weapon Training Scheme. Um, until then, I'm Mr. Duggan. Ciao.